Today, I'm going to show you how to make a mini crossbow. Start by taking a plastic bottle top, then using a thin screwdriver, carefully poke a hole through the bottle top near the bottom. Carry on pushing and go straight through the other side. It should look like this. Next, we need to poke a few more holes and join them together to make a 1cm slot like this. I used a screwdriver instead of a knife because it's easier to control and safer. Do the same thing on the other side and you should have something which looks like this. Next, take a lollipop stick and slide it through the holes. Then, take your screwdriver and do exactly the same again, slightly higher up than the last holes and at 90 degrees. Slide another lollipop stick in and you should have something which looks like this. Next, we're going to take our screwdriver and carefully poke a hole through the bottle top just above the last stick. Make sure it's parallel and straight. Then use a slightly larger screwdriver to open out the hole. It should look like this. Next, we need to take a heavy-duty elastic band, not one of these thin ones, and hook it over the front of the bow. Then wrap it around each arm of the crossbow a couple of times, and you should have something which looks like this. We're going to start by firing a cocktail stick, so snap off one of the points, then load it into the crossbow by pushing it through the hole at the front. Use your thumb to keep it in place, then fire when you're ready. It's strong enough to just pierce a cardboard box. If you want to make a more substantial arrow, try using a wooden skewer. Or for a more child-friendly arrow, take a cotton bud and remove the cotton from one end. You can customise your crossbow by using different coloured bottle tops. And if you want to find out how to make a flaming arrow, take a look at my mini bow and arrow video by clicking on the link at the top on the right hand side, or the link is in the description. I hope you've enjoyed watching this video, if you want to see more, click on the links on the right hand side, or take a look at my YouTube channel page. Stay safe 